The Bear Paw Scout Camp is an opportunity. It's a place to adventure, it's a place to learn and grow. Bear Paw Scout Camp is empowering because it creates an environment where Scouts can have this incredible experience that they wouldn't be able to have anywhere else. Fantastic place for our Scouts BSA youth to get the experience of living out in the wilderness as well as having exciting adventures. Bear Paw Scout Camp is like a home. It's a home away from home. Nestled amongst the vast Nicolet National Forest in Mountain, Wisconsin, Bear Paw Scout Camp is over 300 acres of fun and adventure for scouters of all ages. Bear Paw Scout Camp is phenomenal. I could live here. <laughs> this place has everything. Including the camp's most noticeable feature, a secluded, pristine Northwoods Lake. Bear Paw Lake is 42 acres of serene beauty with a calm, no-wake boating policy. 75% of the one and a half miles of shoreline is owned by the camp, with the remaining 25% belonging to uninhabited Nicolet National Forest. Beautiful days that you can get out onto the waterfront. Today we saw paddle boarding, small boat sailing, swimming. And with merit badges to match every activity, the waterfront is not only a great place for rank advancement, but also exploration. In the evenings, you can go around the whole entire lake with a guard boat out and you can look at some of the awesome flora and fauna we have here and watch the sunset on Bear Paw Lake. My troop is here for week five of summer camp. Uh, we have 12 of our scouts here this week enjoying beautiful Bear Paw. Um, taking several merit badges as well as enjoying um, a lot of adventures that we can't really get back in Beaver Dam, such as the beautiful lake as well as the shooting range. So they're very, very excited to be here at camp. Our shooting sports ranges are one of the best in the Midwest from the pistol shoots, archery, and rifle and shotgun. The ranges provide so many ways to build self esteem and not just through merit badges whether it's shooting trap, where they can physically see the clays being broken in the air, um, or it's on the rifle ranges where they have their targets and they can take their targets and take them home and say, look at this, I shot this target. Whenever kids come off the ranges, especially first timers, there's always smiles, which is fantastic. The staff at Bear Paw does an excellent job of making sure that the scouts and the leaders have the opportunity to experience new things in a safe environment, including high adventure, kayaking and whitewater rafting. They can also go on ATV rides, rock face climbing, bike hikes. All of that's challenged by choice because it gives them a new experience. So we have our bouldering wall inside of our adventure building that gives them a, a test pad. Going from there, they get to expand on that and go into our natural rock faces. Uh, so it's a great place for challenge by choice because it gives them that opportunity to learn some of those on the fly decision making skills that are necessary for life. And, and the nice thing too is about the variety of programming. So I've got scouts from that are 17 and a half all the way down to 11. We're able to, to leverage some of those high, more high adventure activities to keep some of our older scouts occupied. But at the same time, I'm able to get some of my younger scouts very involved. Our STEM program uh, was started a couple years ago. I was really excited to watch that grow. A brand new STEM education center completed construction in March of 2021, providing a whole new facility to this rapidly expanding program area. My scouts are very interested in STEM. I've got half of my troop taking auto maintenance. I had two scouts do that last year. They absolutely loved it. Now the remaining part of my troop is taking that merit badge. Um, perfect one to learn life skills. I mean, who doesn't have a car in their future that doesn't need to know how to do basic maintenance? Where are they gonna learn it from? Scouting can do that for them. And there's no better place than camp for learning the scouting basics like outdoor skills and ecology. EcoCon, they have a lot of nature trails, uh, different animals, snakes, birds, all sorts of fun things there. Outdoor skills department has a lot of great things going on, great staff and a lot of great attitudes. You can also head up to Handicraft, uh, where they do a lot of painting and art type projects, basketry. 
And one of the most important questions on every scouter's mind, what are we having to eat? Bear Paw Scout Camp offers both a premier dining hall facility and patrol style in campsite cooking. Um, we adjusted some of our scheduling, so running our meals before flags, just to help facilitate that so that patrol cooking units could get their food, cook and clean, and then still join us for flags in the morning and in the evenings. What I like the best about the patrol cooking is my girls, we have it set up that we only do breakfast together for cooking. It gives them a chance to gel, to work together. But the other thing I like about it here at Bear Paul is they have the opportunity to go to the mess hall to eat. It's an opportunity for all the scouters, the adults, the youth, everybody, to visit with others. There's a lot of lifelong friendships made that wouldn't be made if it wasn't for being able to just go to the mess hall and, and eat with each other. So the atmosphere at Bear Paw Scout Camp is one of inclusion for all. Scouts can have this incredible experience of becoming a part of this huge family of people. Everybody that comes through this gate is made to feel like family. It's fun, it's friendly. So we've had a lot of great kids coming through camp, earning a lot of merit badges, earning a lot of scouting experience, making the Scout Handbook come alive. Through adventures beyond the expected.